the very first turns of the day are made on this huge hanging snowfield called the triangle face. So if you fell or got avalanched on that, you'd almost definitely fall to your death. Jim and Mad Show, Jim and Mad Show. <laughs> that was perfect, Mads. <laughs> Nope, not that. It's all about winging it in the kitchen. <laughs> Yo, Mads. Hey, Jimbo. All right, I got an idea for tomorrow. Uh, yeah, hit me. What do you think about the Amora Vita on the south? Yeah, I mean, you know how I feel about south-facing lines midwinter. It's just super hard to nail. I know you don't like south-facing lines, but I really think we could nail this one. Also encouraged by the fact that we haven't seen that persistent weak layer. Yeah, I think our main concern is gonna be the triangle face, but I feel like with the stable conditions, we could be in for a treat. Yeah, early start for sure. What about like 3 a.m.? Yeah, pick you up at three. Okay, see you at 3 a.m. It is 3.34 a.m., which is the best because there's no rules. First time in the park in a couple of weeks. It's been a terrifying season so far. The conditions are really improving and have improved lately. We got a bunch of snow. It's really stabilized. A lot of the avalanche problems that we were dealing with before have kind of disappeared. I'm so stoked to be out here with you, Mads. Oh, I'm so stoked too. Four thousand feet up. Keep her going. It's about five degrees. It's cold as shit. The whole way up was so shady and so freaking cold. It's just been nugget mads all day. Nugget mads is when it's really cold out and Mads gets in the high alpine and she like starts putting on enough layers and then her neck just kind of disappears. <laughs> she just looks like a little nugget. We're here at the top of the South Teton. Yeah, kind of a long walk this morning. Yep, especially because we've been going pretty hard the last week. Yeah, yes, yeah. It's been intense. <laughs> cut to all the, Drew, cut to all the fun stuff. Thanks. Mads had a huge week. You I, had a huge week. I had a big yesterday. crush it. Let's ski this thing. Woo! The very first turns of the day are made on this huge hanging snow field called the Triangle Face. This one happens to be 40 degrees, so pretty steep, over a thousand feet of exposure. You take a fall on the Triangle Face and it's probably fatal. Only thing is this tiny little pocket, but I'm just gonna go right there. Oh, it's not good. Like I was saying, tiny pocket. <laughs> it's good! Yeah, Madison. 
Jesus Christ. That was awesome. All right, Mads, this is gonna be an on-site for you, but you've got it, no doubt. Radio when you get there. Let's go, Jim. It's a uh, little bit like breakable crust. I'm on the right. She never got a win. Yeah, it's really bad. I, it's bad. The key is to get you a filmer like Eric. Making his way down, <laughs> crushing on maybe the worst conditions of the season so far. <laughs> worst conditions so far. There's always a new worst conditions. Part, pretty rough. Bottom part, best turns of the day. I know, just like refrozen sastrugi oh bullshit. Punch crust. Why did I keep it on the feet? Dude? I don't know. You ripped it though. Yeehoo! Oh yeah. Oh no, flat. Today felt totally different compared to the last time we tried to go out and film a ski line. It just didn't feel right. And then of course it wasn't right. And then today it was like we all know it's it's the right day to do this. A lot of things are working right now. Yeah, I agree. Let's keep it rolling. Let's keep it rolling. Feeling gassed, but we're going for it tomorrow. Hopefully the conditions align with us again, and I think they will. I'm gonna try to rest before another day. Whew. Teton hard bitch, over and out. Oh no! I just called my ex-boyfriend, shoot. Love that. Ski drawing, it, it changed my whole way I, I think about skiing. Now I picture gravity as a, as a horse whole new level, honestly, for me. I can't be calling people on the phone. You might call that high alpine variable. No shit. <laughs> oh! Coconut oil is good for the skin. Breakable crust, kind of like Taco Bell, you know what I mean? So sorry, but dialed you. Hope you're well. Who's your daddy?